European Parliament's fact-finding mission to Catalonia to evaluate the Catalan language immersion system in schools has faced strong criticism on the second day of the visit. This is Catalan News in 100 seconds. Nine MEPs, most of them from the Conservative bloc in the EU Parliament, visited two Catalan schools today to assess the immersion policy. Catalan Minister Marichel Serret said the commissioners were biased, while the main teachers' union in Catalonia said it was a farce. Ven a jam un discurs manipulat i amb una idea predeterminada. És una visita que realment no té cap interès en conèixer el nostre model. Spanish Prime Minister Pedro Sánchez has confirmed that he will meet with former Catalan President Carlos Puigdemont and Esquerra President Oriol Junqueras. He will meet them separately after the amnesty law is passed by Congress. The Socialists Esquerra, Junts and Comuns have presented a bill in the Catalan Parliament to ensure that serious child abuse crimes never expire. The aim is that crimes of this type are not limited to a specific period of time and that civil liability has no expiry. Això no només beneficiarà a les víctimes de pederastia a l'Església, sinó a totes les víctimes d'abús institucional i a les víctimes d'abús intrafamiliar. The Catalan Department of Climate Action issued a preventative air pollution alert due to high levels of particles in the air of 40 municipalities in the Barcelona metropolitan area today. Authorities recommend using public transport and reducing construction work. Have you ever dreamt of being an astronaut? Now could be your chance. The Catalan Hypatia Mars Association is looking for five women who are passionate about science and space to be part of a new simulation mission in 2025.